Hello and welcome to a quick Unity tutorial. So in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make your own credits. By this I mean something that looks something like this. So, oops, try that again, there we go. Uh, don't worry about all these 623 errors. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, that's because I got the timing wrong on the whole script. You'll see what I mean in a minute. So, last episode we did a rotate script where I showed you how to rotate your own little cube and make it look all mysterious and stuff. Well, I didn't show you how to make it mysterious, but you can make it mysterious yourself. But, um... And today I'm showing you how to do credits for your game. Now, very simple script to this. Uh, you, you can probably find it on a website somewhere. I'm not sure. But, um... Yeah, like I said, it's very simple. So, that was it, if you saw it then. But, um... Let's get into it then. So, create a new... Java, no, not JavaScript, C sharp script, and just name it something like credits. I'm just going to keep this on here, get rid of the main aspects of it all, just keep all the text there because that's just annoying. Um, to help you try and like layer your text, if you click on one, control D. I'll duplicate it, and if it, I'll just do it on the bottom one. Um, control D. Oh, let's go under. There we go. Control D, duplicates, and then hold Control, hold the top one, the Y like the Y axis, and then it'll allow you to drag it down. Rather than freely, it'll do it on a kind of like easier to control sort of thing. So that's how I did that. So let's get into the actual code inside of this then. Open up the credits and we're gonna start off by making a no we might no we won't need that. Delete your um start and we're gonna start off by making some variables. So the first one being the camera so we need to make a public game object camera semicolon we need to make a public interval speed uh, make it equal to one and then we need that's it that's all we need is just them two um, pretty much like our rotate we're going to be using the vector three again so Let's do camera dot uh, transform dot translate open brackets vector three dot uh, down or up depends where your camera is starting from. If you want the text to go from the bottom to the top, then you want it down. If you want it to go from the top to the bottom, you want it to go up, and you want your camera to be in the right place. Uh, I'll show you. Oops. Let me just turn that off. So like that. Um, right. So times by delta. Sorry, no. Time. Dot dot delta time. Times by speed. Closing brackets. Semicolon. That's it. We're done. Well, for now. And uh, next, you're gonna want to make. Oh, why is that in the way? Get out of the way. No, as in disappear. Don't just fade out and then. God damn it. Right. So. Get off. Let's make a new I numerator. And we're going to call this weight. Four. Opening and closing brackets. Open parentheses and closing parentheses. And then 
we're gonna write inside of here yield return new wait for seconds brackets and then however long it takes so I'm gonna guess and put 20 seconds and then I'm gonna do application dot load level in here I'm gonna put level uh, pressing escape to shut down that menu so that it doesn't go on to uh, quality level or whatever it was and then up here we're gonna put public string level there we are and then we can shut the script down because we're done as far as I'm concerned we're done I might have forgot something I don't know oh dear I've changed round I don't know default screw it I like this one better ah we're on the other side typical okay doke so our camera we've not got set up yet so we need to add a camera uh, camera there we are now it's up to you how far away it is completely up to you just make sure that the text is off the screen to begin with yep there we go so I'm gonna have mine a bit further away no a bit closer Move down a bit so that I can just test and a little bit closer okay that'll do off the screen there we are now we're going to make a new game object, a new empty game object. We're going to call it um, credits. After that, we'll make another new game object, and we'll call this BG Music. And then that's it, I believe. So in the credits, we're going to get our new script that we just wrote drag it in, drag a camera in there put the speed up to whatever you want, I'm going to leave it at 1 because that's a reasonably good level uh, we'll put um, minus 1 oh, screw it now, we'll just what what other one have we got, we've got we've got that so we'll load that one Come credits and we'll load that level. Make sure you go to build settings, add the current level, and add cube rotation, whichever one you want first. You probably want the cube rotation first when you build it. Um, yeah, so here we are. Now, our background music, we're just going to drag our music onto here. This is a um, free song I downloaded from play on loop and um, yeah it's just a pretty simple song you heard at the beginning but um, not getting into that one so we've dragged that into BG music and we're gonna loop it seems like it is a loop song and um, I'm gonna turn the volume down to about 0.2 or 0.1 for the video's sake so here we go let's test So now I'm going to speed it up. I'm going to put the camera to go 1.5. There's no points. So I'll just put 2. So there you go. Okay, I was a bit off with the timing. No, I wasn't. I don't know, actually. I forgot to call it. Credits. Oh, nine minutes, that's bad. We need to update. We need to 
start con routine uh, brackets wait for brackets 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 there we go so pretty much just start con routine opening brackets wait for opening and closing brackets and then closing brackets and then a semicolon breather jesus christ right that was harder than you think Just gonna pause. Okay, anytime now. There we go. So, yeah. And um, that's been credits, the end credits, I should say. I might, I might do a tutorial on opening credits for like flying through a city or something. It all depends if I can find. A model of a city. If you find a model of a city that I can do a tutorial on and use it in my tutorial, then link it to me in the comments and I'll I'll do one. But I don't know. And I just I pretty much this yeah yeah. I'll have a look because I wanna I wanna do that as well because that'd be pretty cool. Like a flyby of a city, you can flying through. Made by Summit Summit presenting something something or whatever. So, thank you for watching. I've been Fuzzy Two K Eleven. This has been Unity Three D Quick Tutorials, or as I'm calling them, Unity Quickies. I don't know why. It's a bit strange, but okay. So, see you later. Bye.